But we are working on the B-ships now. I think I got two done the other day uh, on our OP list challenge. For those who don't know, the OP list challenge is get wins on every single ship hard mode with pause without using hacking or cloaking unless the ship starts with either of those. So, uh, basically, I actually, I think I described it in a YouTube comment better. OP list challenge, you can't buy cloaking or hacking. I think that might be the better way to describe it. You can't buy it, because if you can't buy it, then if your ship starts with it, then, you know, you still can't buy it. But we've done the Kestrel B, and we've done the NGB. So let's see where we want to go here today. Singing can kill your voice. Combine it with streaming if you hate your voice. <laughs> I love my voice. But my voice does get really tired. I've actually had a uh, a number of issues with vocal fatigue because I because I sing and I stream. So uh, especially when I play FTL because I get so salty and passionate and yell at the video game so much. Random until a B ship. Oh, I've already done the Forever Alone pie boy. You missed Forever Alone. It took us it took us a couple attempts, but we did Forever Alone on uh, on Monday. So. There was some salt on the first run, I will definitely say. I don't know if I'm ready for a Fed B run, honestly. You know, let's do a Zoltan B. Uh, this is the ship, I think, with the least starting power in the game. Uh, is that right? Or is that the Zoltan C? I can't remember. One of these... Ah, uh, it's this one because it's got the level 2 backup battery. Let's do Zoltan B. I want to start off with something not exceedingly punishing. And Zoltan ships are always strong, so we're gonna we're gonna start with some some Zoltan B action. I should do a singing stream. Uh, Small War. If you go back and look through my highlights, you'll see we've done Twitch sings, and I have sung on stream a couple times. So I'm not singing right now, but if you want to check that out, go back and find the highlight where I do some Twitch sings, and you can listen to me sing. I'm pretty sure I've highlighted all those, uh, and I think on Twitch you can highlight them. All right, Tech Pirate. Tech pirate. Let's go ahead and auto fire here. Um, okay. Do, 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 do. I think both of our shots hit there. Beautiful. Got the missile offline. Got the laser offline. Very nice. You'll stay here for now. Well, I appreciate that. <laughs> you can go check out. Check out my singing streams when we're not playing FTL. In about six hours. All right, I usually like to try to get my shield up first on this ship. So, first hundred scrap. That's what I usually like to try to do. Because uh, having no shield after they get through Zoltan's shield can be rough, especially uh, against ships that have uh, like beam drones. Really have nothing to sell. But, uh, let's see here. Oh, goodness. Ah, tired. I stayed up a little bit too late watching other streams last night. Do I want to go to the store? Actually, I stayed up too late playing Teamfight Tactics last night is what I did. We could possibly get long-range scanners if we get 10 scrap from here. If we don't get any scrap going to the store, there's nothing we could get. So, let's just skip it. Trying no pause is fun but tough. Yeah, I'm going to hold off on the no pause for a while. I am, I'm enjoying not getting so salty that I want to kill myself every play every time I play FTL, so. Okay, good. Both of those hit. No surrender. Nice. Make sure we keep the shields offline. I'm not sure if fires can start through Zoltan shields, but I think they can, so we're going to prepare. Prepare for fires. Please don't hit weapon. Okay, that's not bad. Okay, well, that is bad. It just started fires and destroyed my doors. I mean, I guess this isn't terrible because we don't actually have shields, but that's still pretty terrible. It's a fire I can't deal with because I don't have doors. And I can't stay here to fix it. Because I will take damage. Um, well. Hold on. Maybe I can... Can I fix my doors in time? I don't want to do that because I'm going to have to cycle them between heel bay and 
the doors. So let's try to find an empty jump to fix this crap. Hate fires, no two. Yes, there are a lot of bad places to have fires. Okay. Let's do this. Um, let's do this. Okay, that rotating should work. No! Oh, he didn't even fix the doors, man. All right, I think I just lost the run. God damn it. Single Zoltan couldn't put that out a single fire. Yeah, pretty much. I'm pretty sure I just go ended the run right there. Because this guy, I thought he finished the doors. That's why I moved him before he died. Let's see. Are you going to die before you even get here? All right. Restart. What a shitty start. I cannot believe a single solar flare destroyed two systems and started two fires. That's bullshit. That is absolute BS right there. You have a lot of FTL hours already, so you have done it already for me. You've only done a half dozen no pause runs. Oh, okay. Well, it's definitely challenging, so. All right, well, good thing we're not doing a streak. Oh, my God. What are these bullshit starts to this? these runs today, man? This is terrible. This is such a bad start to these runs. Oh, thank God that ion was dodged. Um, I need to get out of here without taking damage, so... I think that shot's already... So I, would be, I wouldn't be killing him right here. Let's take Surrender so we get out. Have result in shield for the two more asteroids that are going to hit. Please don't be three. Okay, we dodged one. That's good. Okay, all right. Oh, what a crappy start to both these runs. Friggin' um, what should we call it? Hazards all over the place. Come on, game. Don't be so dumb to me. Okay, this is better. Hey, did my cello exam yesterday think it went well? Nice. Cello exam. I didn't know you played cello skill in there. That's cool. Thank you for was it like a chair test? Or? And think of the host too. What is a, what is a cello exam in your in your school or orchestra or whatever? So I remember chair tests for who is first chair, second chair. Wow, that's some good scrap games right there. Your Wi-Fi is playing. I'm going to have to go try to fix it. See you. All right, Smallware. I'll be here. <laughs> Sell some drill parts. That's a good amount of scrap early on. Grade 3 exam. Okay, yeah, I don't know what that means. But I'm glad it went well, sir. I'm glad to hear it went well. Okay, that's good. Tito two, I guess. I hate this ship layout. You can't hit more than four rooms. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. These are not dodging shots, though. It's nice that they have not been dodging. Yeah, I don't think I can get four rooms, no matter what I do. They keep switching weapons. That's nice for us, though. You said you knew about chair test. Did you play? Yes. Uh, well, yeah. I was a uh, clarinet. I was a clarinet player, so I was in band, not orchestra. But uh, yeah, chair tests were the things I know about. Holy crap! And that's right before store. Okay. All right. That's selling. That might actually get me my shields now. What a start to this run! Holy crap! This is much better. This is more like how I like these runs to start. Give me the shields. Okay. We now have shields. That was so much scrap. This is the ship I got my first win with. Love it, to be fair. Really? You got your first win on the Zoltan B, huh? Even before the Zoltan A? Wow. Okay. Cool. Uh, 
I just need power to my shields and my O2 online. All right, his weapons are off, so we can do this. Bum, bum, bum. Whoops, I, I did not mean to. I needed to have one of those go to shields. Value point and shields, of course. Why wouldn't he? Uh, I'm trying to get a run going with NGA now. Pretty rough ship. NGA is a little rough, yeah. It's not the worst, but definitely not the best. Hello, Rand. Uh, am I of the Althor clan? Halas, I am. Or at least my name is based on the Althor clan. <laughs> good, uh, good, good knowledge or way to know that reference. So we're going to do this, then we can take power out of engines to shields once our resultant shield is about to go down. Uh, you got a crew kill in Sector 1 and got about 60 scrap value from it, plus about three other double rewards. Holy crap. Nice. The wheel always turns. And what? Oh, I can't remember the whole intro. And some say it's new beginnings, but it's it is a beginning or whatever. It's been so long since I've actually uh, <laughs> read the Wheel of Time series because I will read tons of other book series. Like I just read all. I read all of the. Um, I read all of the, uh, basically if there's a sci-fi fantasy series out there, I've probably read it, but, uh, way to, way to know that reference. You have to go to D and D. Hope you all have a good stream. All right, Skillionaire. Enjoy. Holy crap. That's, that's actually really nice. We could maybe go Ion run here. Um, So if I get that online, it'll fire even faster than one of these ion blasts. Hmm. <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to think about this. It's 50 scrap to even get another weapon online. Or I just sell it. Do they say the wheel always turns? They do. Uh, the, I forget exactly. The intro to each Wheel of Time book has this, like, thing where it talks about the wheel turning. It's, it's, a, it's a very, I think it's an Asian mythology type um, thing oh man or just like or I just get a burst laser too okay um, 30 plus 25 okay so that'd be 50 51 plus 30 is 81 I have just enough scrap to get burst laser okay I could go ion run or I just get burst laser too sorry Sorry, folks who wanted an eye on run, but uh, that is just too good to pass up. Sounds like King, but it also to ge relatively general reference. When did when did Stephen King write The Dark Tower? Because if it sounds like King, then King was sounding like Robert Jordan. Because Robert Jordan, <laughs> I think, wrote The Wheel of Time way before The Black Tower was a thing. It always says this is not the beginning, but is a beginning. Something along those lines. Yep, that sounds about right. That's that's what it says. Yeah. Whoops, I meant to manually search, but I could have lost crew. So that's why I didn't do that. He wrote in the 70s. Black Tower started in the 70s. Really? I thought that was more recent than that. Yeah, I've been on the stream for a whole 20 minutes. Didn't he take forever to finish it? Well, I guess that actually is the same as uh, Robert Jordan. He actually died before he finished his series. You caught the beginning. You sure did. This is a really good weapon system for him, too. Please don't board me, though. Okay, that's a good dodge. All right, no weapons. Beautiful, okay. Man, Burst Laser 2, that's a huge pickup. Well, then maybe Robert Jordan did copy Stephen King. I don't think he did, but. 1982, he started writing in the 70s, okay. G G George J.R.R. 
is going to pull a Robert Jordan where he doesn't finish the movie, uh, finish the book. <laughs> yeah, even when they finished the TV series it was based on. That still blows my mind. The freaking Game of Thrones. He hasn't finished the series, but they just wrote an ending to the to the to the TV series. It's like, are you, are you trying to get him to finish the ending, or you can't just wait for him to finish it? I mean, of course you can't do that, but still, it's funny to me, or ridiculous to me. Oh, okay, we actually want him to leave because this gets us a free weapon, so we just need to let him leave. So we need to repair shields and then fly away. If you ever see that the uh, thing is charging super fast, that means they are, um, it's a quest thing. It's a relatively general reference that probably is used back well before both of them. Yeah, well, and like I said, I know in the case of the Wheel of Time, it's a, um, it's a very Eastern, a lot, of, he has a lot of Eastern influence in his uh, writing. After them. You should read these Wheel of Time series you speak of. Sounds interesting. It's very different than um, Stephen King's version of um, sci-fi fantasy. It is more Lord of the Rings. Um, although I would say it's a much more developed world than Lord of the Rings. It was one of the first truly epic um, sci-fi fantasy series I read. Whoops, I meant to go for his weapons. And by truly epic, I mean it's 13 books long, I think. I forget exactly how many books it is. But the guy who started writing it, writing it didn't finish it. And another guy, who I read a number of his books, who's one of my favorite authors, had to finish the series after the guy died. So... Oh, man, all these stores. Well, I guess I can buy fuel. Oh, we have eight jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. More developed than the L-O-R-T-R-O. Well, more extensive story than the Lord of the Rings books. Because it, Lord of the Rings world isn't really fleshed out until you get into things like Silmarillion and all the other stuff. Oh, my gosh. Oh, gosh. 27. 59 scrap. I'd have to sell Zoltan Shield to get Flak 1. <laughs> 72. Or I sell, you know what? Okay, We're, this is so inefficient. I keep, I keep selling weapons to change my weapon loadout. Oh, this is so inefficient. Oh, God. Jordan knew he was going to die, so he left copious notes. Yes. Yes. Hello, great. I was late. What's up, Battlecore? So I guess I, I wouldn't say that Robert Jordan's world is more fleshed out. What I would say is the epic story is more... It's a more um, extensive story. Couldn't be finished in three books. Took 13 to tell the entire story. Okay, all right. All right, we can sell that at the store. They really are trying to give me ions this run. You've read Silmarillion, Children of Her, and Baron Luthien, and Fall of Gondolin, so he was about... So I was about to fight you. <laughs> I actually haven't read those. Uh, I never read any of the extended universe <laughs> stuff of uh, Lord of the Rings. Because once I finished Lord of the Rings, I started going into other ser series. All right. Long range scanners is good. So we've got shields. And we've switched out weapons a couple times. So I've been really inefficient with my buys here. I don't want to go to a sun because I killed us last time. Who finished the rest of the books? Uh, a guy named Brandon Sanderson. Um, agree to all... No. Side with Fugitive. Yes. Yes, you are my pilot and that gives me extra power. 
Um, and Brandon Sanderson is known for writing um, a bunch of his own stuff. He, Brandon Sanderson is known for writing very extensive magic systems in his world. Very well explained, well thought out, and original magic systems. He wrote the um, one of my other, other favorite series, which is Way of Kings. Um, and then uh, possibly his most famous would be um, alright would be um, god damn it uh, what is it called what is that series called okay I just need to go in here so I don't lose my shields to ions Oh, what is that series called? Mistborn. The Mistborn series is probably his other most famous series. Okay, there we go. Because we are addicted to flax here. That's right. Why did I switch from Versailles 2 to flax? Yes. We're addicted to flax, and also flax are OP. Flax are OP, and I always want to have them. Um, they're better at getting through shields anyway, and if I'm going to use Pike Beam, I, if I could have, I would have sold the Pike Beam for the flak, but it wasn't, the Pike Beam didn't sell for enough. So, alright, I think I get this. Addiction can kill you, and Gather's killed too. This is very true, Zaloni Melon, and my addiction to flax might get me killed. <laughs> because I kept changing my weapon to load out. Oh, Shogi, I meant to tell you, um, you had mentioned Warframe yesterday, and it's so random, but last night I got a random Facebook message from my college roommate, who is also a gamer. He's the one who actually got me back into EverQuest back in college. And he said, hey, Ryan, it's good to talk to you. I know it's, this is out of the blue, but are you still streaming? I remember you talking about streaming on Facebook a long time ago, and I wonder if you're still doing that. I was like, yeah, I'm still streaming. Why do you ask? He's like, well, I've been watching some people. I thought I'd come check it out. I also wanted to ask what you play. And when we got to talking a little bit, he said he's been playing Warframe like crazy. He has like over a 1,000 hours in Warframe. So that's two people in a day or two that has been talking. Okay, you can lose crew from this. Talking about Warframe. And I told him I had played it before, but it's been a while. So it sounds like I need to try to play some Warframe again is what it's sounding like. Scrap some of the debris. Okay, we can now get second shield. I need power, but at least we got second shield here. It was just so, so funny that randomly two people, two good friends of mine, mentioned playing Warframe again. I know, he said he's actually been getting a little tired of it. But maybe uh, having a friend to play with again to help a noob will get him excited about it again. I was like, well, oh, I don't know if I want to force you to play it, but... If I have multiple people who are playing it, I feel like that would be more fun than me just playing it myself, which is what I did last time. I'm going to gamble this. Yes! Alright, and I could sell that. Uh, I don't think I have anything else to sell, do I? No. Oh, that's a dead end, too. Well, let's just go here, sell and buy fuel, then. I never know, you could be, like, invisible to ions like that. Oh, invincible to ions? Yes. Yes, if you have two uh, Zoltans in the shield room, Zoltans power things uh, when they're standing in it. If you have two in there, they it can't depower it when they just provide free power. So I really want power, but we're just like out of fuel. Warframe is a wheel. <laughs> there are no beginnings, but it... There are no beginnings or endings. No true beginnings or endings, but it is a beginning. Yeah, Zoltan power can't be removed by ion. That's the real way to say that, I guess. But I might I might uh, download it on Steam tonight and look into trying to play it again. I don't know if I'll stream it again, but maybe it'll be a fun thing I can play. Maybe I will. I don't know. We'll see. Because what I remember of Warframe when I streamed it was it getting really grindy. Oh, nice. Just enough damage. Beautiful. Okay. All right. So let's get one power. And then we can do that. 
cool. Uh, with four Zoltans, two shields, that's crazy. That's true. Zoltan of Clone Bay protects from pulsars, for example. Ah, uh, yeah, that's and that's something I forget to take advantage of as well sometimes. Aren't all games guy all all games grindy? Um, I wouldn't say so. Grind um, is like something where you have to do the same thing over and over and over and over again. I wouldn't call FTL grind, even though you're doing similar runs every time, but you're not you're not doing literally the same run every time. To me, a grind means you're doing literally the same thing every time. The, the reason I like um, roguelike so much is because every run is different. And to me, if a run in every run is different, that doesn't feel grindy. Um, I kind of need the fuel. I'm actually going to take that. To me, truly grindy games are you like have to run the same instance over and over. Like, wow, playing the same dungeon over and over and over again. Or, um... What else is grindy? I don't know. That kind of thing. The guy who beat Doom using only fists, so there's no need to grind. Iron immunity and making fights safe is very important in FTL. Oh, crap. They, oh, my God. Free borders. Oh, this is so stinking bad. Man. God damn it. I hate this fucking event. This is probably going to make them go into my piloting. Come on. I need... Don't... If they kill my O2, I might have just lost this run right there. Okay, okay. This is such a bullshit fight right here. Look at their insane weapons too. Flat that's a that's a five or six power weapon system versus my four power weapon system with fucking three free borders, man. This is so stupid. How much health do I have? Twenty two. So if a missile hits me in the pilot, I'm dead. Well, if anything hits me in the piloting, I'm dead. <sighs> this game is so dumb, man. This game is so effing stupid. That's just that's just a bullshit amount of stuff that they have. The fact that they have this much shit, Sector 3, is just stupid. I don't think I can recover from this either. O2 is dead and doors are dead. So I have to fix doors. Rotating my guys between healing, heal bay. But no, I need to fix O2 first, don't I? GG two runs in a row because of bullshit. GG two times in a row because bullshit of them killing my O2 Endors, man. Oh, that is so fucking dumb, man. That shit pisses me off so much because I had a really good run. Getting free crew and flak plus my weapon system was good. I was a little behind because I traded out weapons, but... That's just stupid RNG that just ended my run right there. That's so goddamn stupid. Oh, uh, yeah, it happens. It happens. Okay, I need to kill this thing because I'm about to take damage here because this is an insane setup too. That was such an OP ship, man. And that's why, that right there is why I think Zoltan sectors are possibly scarier than slug sectors, abandoned sectors, and certain, um, 
in certain situations. Right there. Free Zoltan borders. Bypassed my Zoltan shield. Destroyed my O2 before I could uh, vent them out. That was just a bunch of bullshit right there. Who would have won an advanced ship with Intel saying how to defeat a whole entire empire? I don't know what you're saying right there. Oh, freaking hell. Thank you for free crew. Thank you for free crew. Okay. Still not as quite as good a start as our previous run where we had uh, shields upgraded by like halfway through sector one. Yeah, please don't do links without uh, asking for permission. Come on, man. I have had a sector one hazard all three runs so far. Oh, that's a freaking good dodge right there. Six fuel. It's a really good deal. I'm going to take it so I can hopefully, again, not take... Eh, I'm still going to take damage. Oh, I need like three more dodges or something. Get me the hell out of here, man. Oh, thank God. All right. Um... I don't have anything to sell. I could only afford long-range scanners, so I think I'm going to skip the store here. Okay, so I have maybe eight jumps here if I go through here. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two, three, four, five, six. And that'll let me know if I get it. We'll go this way. Shogi, how much uh, Warframe have you been playing lately? Have you been playing like a lot or is it just like a fun diversion you've been doing? Because I feel like I've seen a number of people playing it lately. Um, we could take damage here. Yes! No damage. Fun diversion. Okay. I'll have to check it out. I mean, I have a feeling if I start playing with this friend again, I'll get, like, addicted to it. Because that's what happened when he got me playing EverQuest again. <laughs> but it also got me to play enough EverQuest to get my Bard Epic, so... All right, do I get level two piloting for the chance at the blue option here? I'm going to do it. I think somebody asked on my YouTube was like, is it worth spending the 20 scrap when you need it for something else? And I think it is. Oh, God, free borders. All right. Where are they? Especially okay, they're over there. Okay, they're in my weapons room. All right, they'll, for they'll force me to heal bay, and... Okay, this is fine. Get vented humans. All right, Mantis wins that fight. No losing crew here. Nice. You'll play floor like an hour or so, but it's more fun to play with friends. You can say EQ is more addicted than Warframe will ever be. Yeah, I'm sure. So I probably won't get that addicted, but it might be something to fun fun to play with, with you and and him. His name is Mike. So it was so random though, because he's my roommate in college who I haven't talked to literally in years. One, two, three, four. Four, five, six. So I will be able to get an extra jump. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, cool. You tried the strike once. Now three of your top five runs are the strike. I don't remember which ship is the strike. Is it's, it's not this one. Strike. I don't remember which ship that is. You enjoy because it it's highly intense action, but it's a nicer version. What do you think of the NG Med Nani augment? I think it's pretty. Um. 
it's very niche. Its use is very niche. Useful in a very few situations. Otherwise, the scrap you get from it is worth more if you can get like a good weapon system online. Is how I would how I would describe it. There are, there are not very augments in this game, in my opinion, that are so valuable that ships start with that you want to keep it. The very few would be Zoltan Shields, Long Range Scanners. I don't know if there's any other augments that ships start with that I think are worth holding on to. Those are the two that I think are worth holding on to. There are ones buying that are, of course, worth uh, pre-igniter, automated reloader, that sort of thing. Okay, we don't need fuel. Crystal Vengeance is great for 40 scrap. That's right. Gaming brings long-lost friends back together. That's right. And it's also my only social interaction sometimes. <laughs> is people I talk to through gaming. Which is a probably very sad comment about my life. Uh, I don't need fuel. Oh, I should hit his weapons. This mini beam might actually do damage because I did that. Come on, hit, hit. Okay, all right, we're safe. Ever played Overcooked 2? I played the first Overcooked with friends. With my friend Tim, who I who is the guy I play uh, Smite with. That's not my brother. Uh, the other one that we've played, we played one the other day that's kind of like Overcooked, but you're like in a spaceship and you're like loading weapons and one person, and you have to like put out fires and fix breaches and stuff. It's kind of a mix between FTL and Overcooked. I forget what the game was called, but it was pretty fun. Does NG not thing work with Clone Bay? Uh, the NG nanobots, NG medbay nanobots or whatever does not work with Clone Bay, no. Um, will I take that scrap? I don't need the drone part, so I'll take that pulp from play payment because that's almost sec that's almost shields right there. Guns of Icarus, that might have been it. Ho oh, ho, okay, okay. Free weapon is great. Let's get shields because now we can have shields. Mantis or rock? I guess we'll go mantis. It might have been Guns of Icarus. It was a space game that was like overcooked. It was pretty fun. We, like, beat it in one sit sitting. It probably took us, like, three or four hours, but we beat it in one sitting. So. I would love to play some Guns of Icarus again. Oh, wait, no. It's not Guns of Icarus. That's something else. That's definitely something else. Oh, my God. Why are we getting so many goddamn asteroid fields today? You know, we're going to do Heavy Laser plus Ion Blast here since it's only got one shield. Okay, that's some good dodges. Okay. Which do I want to hit? Okay, that hit his weapon, so we can get drone control offline. Perfect. I think those both breached too. All right. Okay. All right. That could have been much worse. Praise R and Jesus. Overcooked the space game. Yeah, yeah, that's what it was called. It's called Overcooked in Space. Faster than Overcooked. <laughs> no, I don't remember what it was called. Because Guns of Icarus is that one where you're like, it's first person where you're running around the ship and fighting other ships, right? The one I'm thinking of was top down like Overcooked is. And it's kind of arcadey and cartoony. Baker Henry is the main protagonist of Overcooked the Space Game. <laughs> Commander Baker Henry. Commander Baker Henry. Don't forget his title, sir. Do, 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 do. Commander Baker. He worked long and hard to get that commander. Hmm, that shot actually does go off before. That's good. My apologies, Commander Baker. <laughs> That's right. You better apologize. He didn't go to Commander Baker school for 13 years to be called just Baker. 
All right, uh, store, I could sell an Ion Blast. Good luck, Commander. Thanks, Commander. Everybody's a Commander. You, you're a Commander, and you're a Commander. Everybody gets to be a Commander. I can't believe that in... Um, uh, what's that game I was playing yesterday? There are billions. There was a there was a reference to. Um, what's her face? Whoop! Uh, uh, Oprah. There was an Oprah reference, in friggin'. Um, there are billions. Yesterday, one of the little blurbs underneath said, "You get a, what was it? You get a gun, and you get a gun, or something like that." Like, really? Really? How could I take this game seriously? It's making Oprah references. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, let's get as many jumps for the store and hope we can get something good here. I should turn my O2 back on. All right. Side with Fugitive? Holy crap, I got I got a free Mantis twice so far. That is so stinking good. He's not boarding me. Crap, he's got two shields, though. I should have my Ion Blast online. Oh, nice. Our first three shots hit. That's so good. I need to just keep ioning their shields here. Make sure they stay down. Okay. Get our O2 back online. Just keep not dodging, sir. You know what? I probably can get a much better swipe here. Holy crap. That is six damage. Okay. Getting the weapons offline was great, but let's just kill them. <laughs> I didn't realize there was such a good swipe on this ship. Okay. Yeah, keeping the good DI on stacked on that two shield ship was very helpful all right i could get another weapon up or i can get second shield let's wait and see what's in the store first because if there's a good weapon that i can combine with heavy laser or pike instead of the double ions be good okay you have no shields so of course when i try to do that we just we just succeed all right have something good weapons wise otherwise we're getting a shield upgrade okay Lots of Mantis crew. All right. So no good weapons. Um, well, I could just upgrade my weapons and go all out offense and rely on my, uh, whatchamacallit, my um, Zoltan shield for defense. I feel like that's a valid strat for all the Zoltan ships because they're, they're just, their defense is so good with Zoltan shield. And if I get really overpowering offense, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna Thank go for that. Follow. We're going overwhelming offense here. Thank you for following. FF10 Faith, thank you so much for the follow. Your name looks familiar. Have you followed recently or watching recently? Your name looks familiar. You know what they say? The best defense is a good defense, because that's not what I have currently. All right, all in on the weapons. You've watched recently, okay? Your name? Oh, you subbed. You have a sub. Oh, I think you got gifted a sub. Is probably why. Most likely, Pie Boy gifted you a sub because <coughs> you have the sub cookie. <laughs> well, thank you for following. Welcome to actual following. The best defense is thumor neck thum thermonuclear weapons. So the best defense is nuking your enemies. America sounds like the American philosophy. I'm down. Gifted crew, sub crew reporting in. You already thought you were following? <laughs> Giant alien spiders? No, I don't wanna, we don't want to risk crew. Yeah, either you or Shogi probably gifted the sub. Okay. Scrap some of the debris. I can get power. Um, do I have long range scanners? No, that was my previous two runs that I had long range scanners. So let's just go civilian sector. Okay, store. Don't have anything I want to sell. Could buy fuel. 
I could get level 2 piloting and go drifting through the nebula hoping for another free weapon. Oh, I already have level 2 piloting. We're going drifting through the nebula. Let's do it. Could have gone to the store for possible uh, long-range scanners, of course, but... I never surrender to recruit slavers. We're much better set up for borders now. Let me go get on doors because if I do get boarded, we'll have more, more fun venting that way. Whew. That's a good swipe right there. Oh, I gotta take a free NG. NG's too good, man. NG for blue option, baby. That's like a 50 plus scrap deal right there. Alright, do I want power for my shields? Yes. Next we work on second shields or level 3 dodge, maybe. Value of level 2, O2, or doors. What? Wow, you did call it. Another crew, I hope. And it was an NG crew, yep. Look at all those bombs. Why can't you hold all these bombs? Actually, uh, I might want to hold. Uh, I think we get this shot off. Strangely, the pike beam fires just fast enough with level one um, weapons guy, I guess, to uh, get through with only one ion blast hitting. Okay, you know what? The synergy of dodge plus Zultan shield is really high. So we're going to get third, shield, uh, third, third engine before we even get second shield. Is there any event that needs doors? Yes, there's one where it's like an abandoned fuel station where it's a trap. And if you have level two doors, you can like block them out or something like that. I forget the wording of it, but there, there's one, maybe two events where level two doors could get you uh, a blue option. Oh, that was a double dodge. Okay. See if I can get this halberd beam off before it fires, because it'll it'll do damage to us. Yes! <laughs> it was just about to do damage to us when we canceled it out. Beautiful. Yeah, docking with refueling platform. That's it. Oh no! That NG boarding party when we're fighting against a mantis ship. <laughs> How will I ever cope? With friggin' NG boarding party. It's funny though, Shogi, my friend, uh, my friend who contacted me last night, he's like, I'm gonna have to come by, stop by your stream. He's a very religious person. And so I was like, okay, I'm warning you, I'd love for you to hang out, but uh, I get salty and may swear a little bit. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure I didn't swear nearly as much when I was in college as I do now. I don't know that I swore at all when I was in college, so. Uh, that's a good deal. Am I looking for another store? Like, pr please, please don't judge my language. Vicious boarding NG. So vicious. Um, I'll take that deal. Not having to spend scrap to upgrade um, power is very nice. You didn't swear much either until you went into the military. There you go. And what started me swearing... Oh my god, it's a free flack. What started me swearing was actually... My my hanging out more on Twitch and gaming, so I blame I blame Twitch for my swearing. Holy crap! Do I want this over the double ion blast? Is the question. Yeah, and the answer is of course. Oh, that's so good. And that's right before store where I can sell my double ions. Flack gasm. I learned to curse like all get out. Dare, darn Air Force. Tech pirate. Flack, yes, Flack. Oh my god, Flack, I know. Flack, just, just too OP. Didn't have to sell a perfectly good Verse Laser 2 for that one, I know, right? <laughs> it's like I don't even understand the full value if I don't have to spend stuff like that on it. Um, Nope. Piracy can never be forgiven. And turn off auto fire now. Oh my god, now this is a weapon system, man. Flak 1, Heavy Laser 1, Pike Beam. I'd rather have something other than the Pike Beam, but this is still freaking good, man.
Oh, the double rewards. Oh, 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 the double rewards. Okay, what you got? You got mind control. Uh, no weapons I necessarily just want to have. Do I want to hold on to the ion blast? I think this weapon system is good enough. Let's get... If this had defense drone, I'd 100% get that. Uh, let's go ahead and get mind control. I still have two more spaces for systems. Okay, all right. Still would like to get third shield. I mean, <laughs> second shield. I come back to see blame Shogi. What I do now? Everything. Oh, I was, I was, Shogi. I was telling you that my friend from college. I mentioned that if he does come hang out, he's a very religious person. So prepare for possible swearing because I didn't swear nearly as much in college. That's that's all I said. Nice. And uh, and then we've got into talking to what somebody. Uh, Thank you for the Hallis said they started to swear when they got into the military, and I said I blame Twitch. Inspired unease. Thank you for the follow. I blame Twitch and watching more gamers, making me start to swear more. It was it was it was gamers. It's like the swearing is the raging gamer language. Being too sexy without a permit. That's that's what Shogi's up for. That's right. All right, I'm going to sell more drone parts because that's going to let me get finally level two shields. Although I could just go to the store and they have long-range scanners. They could have long-range scanners. They could have another flak, which I would, enough, I would have enough scrap for. God, I, should, I really should just get level two shields, but I'm going to the store. Lurable use of RNG Jesus references may not sit too well either. <laughs> you, you know, I, you, you joke about that, but I kind of was thinking about that too. But <laughs> praise RNG Jesus. That's so sacrilegious. But no, that's fine. Um, okay, let's get second shield. Finally, finally, we're doing it. We're doing it live. If he's religious, you mean you won't be swearing as much? Or the swearing will increase because he's religious? <laughs> I'll probably try to watch my language a little bit, but... Uh, refugee ship. I think you can lose crew here. I'm pretty sure you can lose crew. I do have a lot of crew, though. But losing any of my crew would be pretty bad. I'm going to ignore the ship because I don't want to... I don't want to gamble this run on something when it's going so well. Like, what's funny also, Shogi, is... Okay, we're not going to Zoltan again. Screw Zoltan's. Is I think my my nephew Josh sometimes watches, you know, Jeannie's my my sister's son, and she, and Jeannie one time said I would hear Josh watching your stream and you get so mad. I'm like, oh crap, was my sister hearing me rage at FTL? <laughs> it's like that's that's pretty embarrassing and also kind of bad. Her hearing me swear like a sailor. Of course, she was in the Navy, so sure she's used to hearing other people swear like sailors, but <laughs> she's. You know, whenever your family hears you swear, that's worse than, like, you know, random people on the internet hearing you swear. Oh, that was a freaking good hit right there. I can't stop effing swearing at any time. I totally have that stuff under control. That's right. <laughs> I'm sure he'll start swearing as soon as he misses, like, one, like, five shots in one volley. Um, you said five shit, but I think you meant five shots. Okay, got our weapon system so freaking strong. So freaking strong. Holy 68 scrap reward, Batman. All right, let's get... Do you want to get power? You know what? I want to save, because if I can get missile defense, I'm, like, set for this run. Damn it. It's these um, solar flares that are... I've been wrecking us this run, so... We have better crew to deal with this. Deal with it this time. And we actually, with our weapons being so strong, we might get out before the flare even goes off. Eh, close, but not quite. Oh, really? Double fire in the door room? Why Why have all of the fires 
from these um, solar flares been in the doors. I'm pretty sure we've gotten a fire in our doors every time we've hit a solar flare today. Although it might only be two solar flares. And the other one was a shot that started a fire. But still, stop setting my doors on fire. It's rude. Um, has Ken never watched your stream? I'd be worried what he would see. What he would say, Genie seems laid back. No, I don't think Ken's ever watched my stream. <laughs> All right, this could lose crew as well. So we're jettisoning the pod because we don't want a mantis to kill my mantis. You're right, Kenton, Kenton would be more uptight about it, I'm sure. That's a big giant missile. But uh, I'm pretty sure he's never watched my stream. Most of my family doesn't even hardly understand what I do. Like, my mom will say, So, what do you do when you stream? <laughs> like, I've had to try to describe it to her like three times. I'm like, uh, I, I play video games and chat with people. Yeah, but what do you do? <laughs> it's like, old people don't understand streaming, man. All right, there's a store. Now, what's funny is I was over at my little brother's house, and his kids were actually watching. His kids are like five, four, and six, or five and seven, or something. And they were actually watching a YouTube video of some other, like, really young kids streaming some kids' video game. And my mom was sitting there watching, and I was like, finally, Mom, this is what I do. This is what I do. This is what you do when you stream? She's like, yes. This is what I do. I still don't think she understands, though. What do you do? Is it like Monopoly? <laughs> you play games like... Like Pinochle? I don't even know what Pinochle is. Oh, crap. How do, I, how do I actually take damage here? How the hell do they get through my shields with that setup? Before I could do any damage to them. What? Okay, good. All right. I remember Ken told me some of the guild in the WoW to lay out the swearing because his kids can hear. I was like, are you wearing headphones? He said, no. <laughs> that sounds like Ken. You change your life so that I can be more comfortable and not offended. I can't wear headphones to protect my kids' ears. That's that is so my older brother right there. That is so my older brother. That is <laughs> that's so stupid. Like really, you can't wear headphones to stop them from hearing swearing that you don't want to hear in a guild that you choose to be in. <laughs> oh god. If that's not like the conservative mindset right there, I don't know what is, right? You need a specific deck to play. What? It's a card game. You always thought it was fun. What's a card game? What are we talking about? Um, and yes, my family is very conservative. One, two, three, four, five. Um, 164 scrap. Like, you must change your life for my comfort. No, I can't change my life. You change your life. What do you think this is? One more jump. One, two, three, four. Hopefully we don't lose a jump. Okay. Oh, Pinochle. Oh, yes. I didn't know that Pinochle was a card game. But it's definitely a different type of card game than <laughs> the card games that I'm familiar with. Hearthstone. Magic the Gathering. All right, pretty good weapon system you have there, sir. Please let me get through your shields. Okay. Not too shabby. Can't doge, so let's do that. Now you can't get through my shields. Nice. <laughs> That's a really funny story, though, Shogi. That cracks me up. I'll have to tell Steven that. <laughs> it's like, were you wearing headphones? No. Could you put them on? I'm not putting. I'm not putting on headphones just because they have to swear. Like you're you're choosing to play WoW with people who are swearing. You should put on headphones. Another pike beam, eh? Stealth weapons, Holden shield bypass, Rockman. 
What I really want is a uh, drone control with defense drone. But since we can't get that, I think we get backup battery, we get fuel, and then maybe get something else here. Small bomb would be not bad, but I don't really want to invest in that. So, and we're not allowed to buy hacking. I could get teleporter. And I do have two mantids. You know what? Maybe we go the teleporter. We, we can only buy two systems. It's one of them screw teleporter, one of them's drone control. So, maybe we can do some boarding here. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Do that by fuel, by power. And now we can board, uh, well, but my pilot is, okay, so we're going to do this. Put the NG on piloting. Then we can go teleport if we want to. Wow, I don't know if I ever knew that the teleporter was in that location. It's like totally a free venting teleporter. Hell, I was offended when we said that. You're like, damn, you have your game sound over the speakers. That's crazy. Guild seemed to apolo apologetic too. I was like, screw that. Tell them to get headphones. That's right. That's. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. That is. That is. That cracks me up. Also, kind of pisses me off, but it's it's funny. Hearing the story is funny. What's your specialty? Piloting. I don't need level three piloting. I got level two already. NG controlled. Yes, that's the green sector I'll take. No Zoltans, but NG's yes. We got mind control and teleporter on our Zoltan gunning ship. Okay. Um. So I say we board in the shield room, mind control, and then move over to the to the clone bay, maybe. We'll see if this works. There, they should kill. Okay. Okay, let's see if, he, if they kill the clone bay with this hit. They don't. I use my shot to kill it. Okay. There it is. All right. They should be able to finish off two. They're just humans. <laughs> Only human. What is that from? That's from something. Dodge this. Matrix. Matrix. Totally a Matrix reference. Just took me a second. Give them nothing. I do not want your NG... Uh... Stuff, whatever it's called, NG Medbot dispersal. Okay, all right. Mindy scrap. Um, do I get maybe one more dodge, or do we save up for the third shield? You know what? We should save up for drone control. We need to get our missile defense online. That's what we need to do. And we have enough for it. So if this door has a uh, defense drone, we can get it. Do, 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 do. Well, I've gotten two mantis from this. I have a feeling I won't get a third, and we're going to take damage, but. Oh my god! That is the third Mantis we got from this. He even has fighting training. Okay. So let's keep uh, the guy on sensors in sensors and move these this guy here. Holy tr three Mantids Batman. That is actually insane. I've gotten three Mantis from that event today. I probably don't get through shields, but I'm going to go for this anyway. If I can get some weapons offline, it would be nice. Oh, nice. We got through. Beautiful. Teleporter. Yay. Yes. Oh, crap. I have no shields, though. Um, crap. We're about to take damage. I'm going to move you there. At least get one shield online. I hope we get some good dodges. Alright. We got one dodge. I'll take that. Only took one damage. That's not bad. Oh, a flak too. That's right before we go into a store too. Although there's like pre-igniter. Maybe we actually use the flak too. But probably not. Because flak two. Way worse than regular flak. And flak one. 
You won again. You love the red tail. Nice. Red tail is a very good ship. I'll agree with that. All right, Flak 2. Let's go sell you. Store have weapon pre-igniter, please. That would be pretty insane. No pre-igniter. Um, do you have drone control? Nope. They have they have the two systems I am not allowing myself to buy. One fuel. Um, we probably get another store. Let me get... I'm going to get one power to have my shields online. I don't want to spend all of my scrap because there's still a small chance we get... Drone, well, maybe not even a small chance, but a, a decent chance we could find another store with the drone control. Okay, we can't go up there. Damn. Hey, what's up, Kenny? By the way, Pepe Boy is here. Don't kill them all. Okay. Um, but I want to kill them all. Okay, if I don't kill them all, I think I get a weapon here, so we will actually not kill them all. But I have a teleporter, mind control, and two mantids. Why wouldn't I kill them all? You ask too much, sir. Let them live. Laser charger mark two. All right, that's a good deal. Again, it's a weapon I kind of want to sell because it's not my favorite. Rand, I have an awesome idea for the challenge. You need to buy missiles in every single store you visited. Do you mean buy the consumable missiles, or if they have a missile weapon, I have to buy the weapon? Search for the ship. Damn. Free hull damage. Are you saying I have to buy out their missiles every... I mean, that would kind of be an interesting challenge on, like, the Rock A. It'd be a reason to do that. The consumables. Interesting. Must buy all missile consumables. Let me write it down. Maybe, maybe after this challenge, I could do something like that. Oh, by the way, Pie Boy, I tried to look up that FTL score bot you were talking about. I couldn't find that. I couldn't find that mod. If you have a link for it, you might want to link that to me. Must buy all consumable missiles. Consumable missiles at every store. Now, here's a question. What if I can't afford them? Do I need to go out of my way to get to every store? And then send all of my scrap and not even be able to afford it. We also work with drones. It's true. If you didn't know, Stins hasn't made it public till a bit later. Oh, okay. Um, we always secure the cash, of course, especially if we're going to a store. Stinks. Okay, so it's somebody. It's a. It's a mod that's not available to public. Okay. Heavy laser two. Wow, they keep offering drone recovery arm. I might need to get a weapon upgrade at some point, but could possibly go heavy laser flak one charge instead of the pike beam. Maybe I don't sell this yet. Or I, oh, I could go flak one double heavy lasers. I really like heavy lasers. If I sell these two, get one weapon power and buy the heavy laser two. I kind of like that. I love my breaches and stuff. His dude often hangs out in Gobbler's channel. Ah, okay. Well, if you get access to it and you think it's worth me downloading, let me know. Um, do I want to do this? Might make it a little tougher with boarding because with boarding, we might do too much damage and accidentally kill our crew. I love me my heavy lasers, though. That would be one, two, three, four, five, six weapon power. If I'm going to do that, I might as well use the charge laser, though. Uh, so it's, what, 20 seconds for a full charge? I don't think it's worth spending the scrap on it. I'm going to hold off on changing my weapons and just buy the fuel. Maybe just get third shield. Heavy laser 2 all day. Yeah, it was tempting. It was definitely tempting. Oh, crap. I, I don't have my people in the right place. I didn't save them in the right place. Uh, so Zin Zin's a border. And Jones is a border. I want to save that. All right, at least didn't get punished here. Hashtag never punished. So 
Let's find the shield room. So we have the human to help us. Rather than NG. And then we go all in on his weapons. To try to take out this missile. That's gonna do damage to us. Oh, we doged it. Okay. Yes! Missile offline. Beautiful. Do we win this fight? I think we should. He's taking a lot of damage. Okay. Just a guarantee. All right, now we're good. Got him. Very nice. Uh, doesn't seem too bad, considering it can probably result in crew kills. What are you talking about? The Heavy Laser 2? Well, my, my worry with Heavy Laser 2, if I had gotten that, was the fact that my crew kills I'm getting from boarding. And Heavy Laser 2 can kill ships more quickly than you are prepared to kill them. So I'd be afraid of killing my own crew, because I have absolutely done that in the past. But selling it when I already have a three weapon, a three power weapon that wouldn't be bad with flak and heavy laser seems seems dumb to buy heavy laser too when I already have that. All right, blue option, shield overcharger. Okay. All right, well, I don't see another store, so I think we just go third shield and hope we get a missile defense soon. Hopefully, we find a drone drone control at some store. I will sell three drone parts, though, because we have a decent number of drone parts. And we'll take that deal. Zoltan or Rebel? Man, I don't want to go Zoltan's, but if I'm forced into a Sector 7 Abandon, that could be really bad. God. Well, I've already lost one run in the Zoltan Sector. Let's go, run Let's go lose another one. Only had Zoltan Shield bypass too. I think I had an option to buy that earlier, but that was before I even had teleporter, so. Fuel. Did I not buy fuel at a store? I am a little low on fuel. Okay, that does connect. Abandoned or abandoned. <laughs> yeah, maybe I'll have a choice of either of either abandoned sector and sector seven. Okay. Um I'm hoping this will work. That there's only level one heal bay. Oh, it worked! Ah, uh, noobs. Holy crap, those dodges, though. So let's just do this. Do this. Maybe get some weapons offline. Okay, we dodged that. Nice. Um, let's make sure we stay ahead in health. It looks like our, our Manta is winning anyway. Good. Beautiful. Oh, man, boarding. You know, I never realized when I decided to do this challenge that if I don't get hacking and cloaking... I'm going to be get boarding a lot more. So this is turning into a get boarding more often challenge. And I kind of like it. <laughs> How to lose a streak equals Mantis B, Sector 2. Choices are both abandoned. Uh, yeah, that's pretty bad. It's a pretty rough choice right there. All right. Um, let me get one extra dodge. I might need to invest in getting this charge laser online so the pike beam soon. Just to have more shots to get through more shields. Okay. Zoltan versus Zoltan. Fight. Alright, has no heal bear or clone bay, so that's nice. Does have hacking, so... This could be bad, especially since it's going to take me a bit to get through Zoltan's shield here. Okay, there it is. Okay, could we add enough shields? And of course he hacked my weapons right as I was uh, 
Rise, I was about to fire. Of course he would. Okay, I had to be careful of all the explosions. At least he didn't hack my shields, I guess. That's probably better that he didn't hack my shields. I have to watch my guy's health. Okay, if you tank it, should be fine. Yeah, nice. All right. Wow. Two Mantis with Mind Control can take on four Zoltans if you do it right. That's why I love Mind Control with boarding ships. Don't forget you have batteries so you can upgrade engines without buying power, for example. Oh, that's true. That's true. Good call. I'm kind of saving my scrap, though. I'm hoping to find a store with, uh, with drone control. And you know, if they have drone control and it doesn't have defense drone, we'll st it's still be worth buying right now. Because we could buy the defense drone later on. Alright. Two, two easy crew kills, huh? Damn it, I didn't put my guys back in place. And they didn't finish healing either. Okay, finish healing, please. Getting ahead of myself here. That's a Vulcan, by the way, they have. not hit their shield so that they don't stop fighting me. Or we can get it for free. Uh, it's true. We could get a free defense drone. We could. That is definitely a possibility as well. 52 scrap. Man. God, boarding is so good. So strange. When I don't have boarding, I feel like I fight ships that are insanely strong. When I do have boarding, well, maybe I just don't care about their weapons as much when I board because we're able to move their crew around so they don't have as much dodge and Stuff like that. All right. Come on, drone control. All I want for Christmas is drone control. Beautiful. It's a combat drone. Oh, there's a halberd beam. Well, that's a straight up upgrade from the pike beam. Okay. All right. Definitely 100% getting that. 100% getting that. I need to get one power in my weapons. Um, I'm going to sell the combat drone. I don't think we'll ever use that. Maybe get the resultant shields, but I don't feel like that's worth a drone part. No useful drones. If they had hull repair or defense drone, this would be great. I could get clone bay. Oh, okay. We got another store here. All right. The lull bird beam. <laughs> lull bird, my favorite beam. Uh, free borders, man. Okay, all right. They only have two crew over there. So I need to take out their clone base so I don't get these extra crew. Okay, good. They're going to kill their own guy. Um, and what I'm going to do is... No, I can't use mind control. I don't want to do this. I think I want to shoot them before I board. I want to make sure I get that. I, want, I need to get the missile offline, and I need to get their clone bay offline. Um, let's get missiles offline first, if we can. Okay, got the missile offline. Perfect. Okay, even more crew. Look at all that crew they got. Okay, okay, don't die, please. Please don't die. I don't really want to give Zoltan the training, but I just need to make sure my mantids, nobody dies. Got it. Okay, all right. Heal, heal. You go there. How much crew do they have? And are, how close are they to repairing this is the question. NG on repair. Okay. Well, as long as they don't have the... Um, oh, you know what I can do? I can make it so that you don't repair it at all. Perfect. 
as long as um, they don't have that thing that makes them be able to keep their crew alive. What's that called? Backup DNA bank, we would have been fine anyway. There we go. All right, go kill this guy. Beautiful. All right. Was there any blue option for combat drone? Uh, there... Hmm. There might be one blue option for combat drone. It's not one I see very often, so I don't remember what it is. But I feel like there might be one. Something to do with Mantis sending a, uh, a drone to distract something, maybe? Yeah. Man, mind control so good, man. I sometimes like mind control better than ha hacking, although hacking is just better. Okay, all right, we got another store. Let's see what this one's got. Pre-igniter? Uh, another flak? Uh, a reconstructed teleport plus clone bait? You know what? I think I might buy the reconstructed teleport so I can get clone bay. That is my favorite setup with boarding. It's probably not worth the scrap, but I'm going to get it because we're pretty strong anyway right now. Holy crap, my phone's going off. Ah, looks like uh, there's some smite announcements going on my friends are talking about. MC can be spanned in every, in every combat and lots of flexibility like hacking. Oh, that's double ion plus glaive beam. All right, let's fight him. It's only two crew, though, so if I can get through his ult and shields pretty fast, hopefully, this won't be too bad. Okay, all right. We, that was really fast. Let's go right in on the Zoltan, because this guy will be slow getting here. Oh, nice. We even dodged the first, first ion shot. Okay. Now we can't get through my shields. Beautiful. Oh, ho, oh. ho. Backup DNA bank, huh? So I now have backup DNA bank and reconstructive teleport. So I really need to get... I really need to get clone bay. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. All right. So clone bay and um, a defense drone. Those are the two things we're looking for. I'm probably going to sell the backup DNA bank because... I'm not actually worried that worried about losing crew. I will get... I'm going to get level two doors. Yeah, I'm going to get just that for now. You know what? There are a few... I'm going to get level two med bay just because there could be possibly a blue option we might get at some point with that. Um, Comes bad on nebula sectors, though, without slug. That's true. Rebel auto ship sits dormant. Ah, okay. That's the one that... Uh, the combat drone... Uh, the game might be hinting broadly about something. Don't know what, though. <laughs> what could they possibly be steering me towards? Well, there's probably a lot of people who wouldn't have spent scrap on... Um, on Reconstructed Teleport. But I love Reconstructed Teleport. I, it's one of my favorite augments. Well... Even more situational than other augments, but I just, I really like that augment. I love my um, borders keeping their training. There's a lot of people who say it's a worthless augment because you can just, if you have clone bay, just um, refresh your guys. But I don't like doing that because I like my, I like to have fully trained mantis borders stay fully trained. We could even dive here if we wanted to. Medbay has nine blue options. Level two Medbay does? Really? Um, are you sure that's not NG's? That sounds like nine. That sounds like what? How many blue options NG's have? Your favorite augment is battery charger? Really? <laughs> you like the battery charger? That's a weird one. Okay, that's a lot of drones. All right, only three humans. Um... Go here. Mind control a human. 
They should all come in here. Then we go in the clone bay. Crap. I was thinking that was shield room. Double small bomb. Okay, we got the clone bay offline. Teleporter is on fire. Should still be fine, though. Didn't take any damage. Not yet. And our Mantid should win this. Got it. Beautiful. Oh, and a free repair NG is perfect. You go beyond doors. Actually, get to work. <laughs> All right, before this fire spreads and kills my crew. That's actually... The only other crew that might be even better than that would be like a rock crew, but I will take a repair NG. That's pretty, pretty badass. Sodium reporting for duty. What's up, bird brain? It sounds a bit weird, but it makes battery more reliable, extra power. Yeah, I could see that, but I just don't know that I'd ever want to spend scrap on that. I like, I will personally just usually buy more power. Salt shaker's ready to deliver. Finally, an engine that's not stuck on piloting. That's right. All right, store. I have enough scrap for a clone bay. I have enough scrap for a defense drone, and I need fuel. So let's do it. Come on. Have defense drone, clone bay, and fuel. You'll always have fuel. Defense drone. Ah, no clone bay, though. All right. Well, we did get our missile defense, so that's great. Um, small chance we find another store. Do I keep the reconstructive teleport is the question. Because if I don't find clone bait, it's a little redundant. Do I want to get another weapon? I think my weapons are fine. I think if I get force shield, that's probably going to be my best buy. Fifth dodge, force shield. I'll save my scrap for a little bit here, but we'll go for uh, the dodge next since we have Zoltan shield. Okay, you don't have missiles, so we will not use defense drone here. Let's separate these guys, because he's going to mind control one of them 100%. Yeah, I got the fuel. There was only three fuel in that store. Wow, those dodges. All right, well, we did. It's only level one mind control, so we got that offline. Ugh, bad dodges, man. Really freaking bad. Okay, well, he can't dodge anything, so. Nice. Now you have no weapons, sir. Of course, we're also in an asteroid field, so that has to do with it, too. He had extra help getting through our shields. Right, let's wait until backup batteries up before we jump. You think reconstructive is still good on medbay? I don't know. It seems. It seems. I, I feel like I've used this word a lot lately. It seems superfluous. Kind of something you don't really need. Um, big giant missile hacking. We have defense drone. Let's go for it. All right. Okay. And we can see we do have another store. All right. Um, sun. Do I want to do a sun? The store, I might do it. It's definitely a luxury item. Yeah. Definitely a hundred. Uh, Luxury item, that's for sure. Okay. Wow, double charge lasers. Interesting. All right, we're going to try what we did last time. Let all these guys come in here and then go into the heal bay while they kill their friend. This worked last time. I have, I have a feeling they're going to have a higher level of heal bay here. Ah, we couldn't get it in time. Thank you. 
All right, he'll be dead. Um, okay, if I think I manipulate crew enough, I should be able to do this. So I'm kill the man, uh, kill the NG, then do this. There, there. Extra borders. I need to be careful here. Let me do this. I'm gonna run them around just a little bit, just to make sure. I hit the wrong button. I hit R instead of T. There we go. There we go. NG boarding party. Four to win. Oh, free repair. That's it's huge. Super glue first? Yes, that's the word I said. Super glue first. <laughs> Just like battery charger, but man, the thing on Zoltan C is a beast. Well, uh, that makes sense. On Zoltan C... When you start with maxed out battery, uh, backup battery, I can see that being useful. All right, we have a store coming up soon. Let's get our fifth dodge, and then we're we are almost we could get four shield right now. Um, so five dodge, four shields, defense drone is hopefully what we'll have. What would be great is if we can get a hull repair drone. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, we'll go to the sun. Since we got that free repair, I'm not as worried about going here. Okay. All right, he's got clone bay. He's got a big giant missile. All right, all right, we got one level down. We'll take that. Okay, clone bay down. Perfect. Good dodge. Frickin' dodge that missile. Man. Even two-man boarding, if done right with mind control, so stinking strong. So stinking good. And we're out before the fire. Haha, <laughs> get wrecked. Means I don't have my teleporter at the beginning of this next jump. Uh, I have NG. 300 scrap, man. Holy crap. We already have the power for uh, four shield. Yeah, we do. We do. We have everything we need, but I'm saving because I knew this store was coming up. Open for whole repair drone. Uh, clone bay. Flak. Oh, we got whole repair. Okay. Um... Flak. Yes. Um, that would be... I would... If I didn't get fourth shield, I could have this entire weapon system online. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Thank you for the follow. Uh, not real Levi. Thank you so much for the follow. Appreciate it, my friend. Welcome to the stream. I think we're giving up on fourth shield to get an eight power weapon system online. I need only one fuel here. This is Sector 7, right? Yeah. Hello, just got here from your YouTube. Been enjoying them. Nice, not real, Levi. Appreciate it. Well, welcome to the live stream where all the YouTube stuff is birthed. Kind of a weird thing to say. How much fuel to get out? I only needed four. I only have three jumps, and I need the one extra to get out of the sector, so we're good. Um, don't want to use defense drone to even stop the hacking from getting through, possibly. I should have been doing this. Wow, level 3 piloting, 4 shields. I'm mainly hoping we make sure the hack does not get through our weapons. Because that would mean he gets out, probably. Alright, this should do it right here. Got him. You not leaving, so... What? Why, why did I say that that way? I don't know. You're not leaving, okay? 
You're, you're hanging out with me. Beautiful. Besides, three shields is enough if we have a whole repair to repair between phases of the boss, so. Okay. Alright. I want one power right now, so I can have all this stuff online, and then we can back up battery, teleporter, mind control, and I need 130 scrap to get power plus the heavy laser online. Levi, isn't it pronounced Levi? Um, well, if it's a biblical name, at least in America, it's pronounced Levi, but... Wow, will we get our fourth free mantis from this? Holy crap. That is the fourth free mantis we've gotten from this event today. Three in this run. That is insane. Um, do I actually want him is the question. Uh, he's more useful than this guy. All right, Hager. Sadly, I don't have any humans to get rid of <laughs> to use for him instead. Okay, I want to see where, where the crew are that we would be jumping. Okay. Four NGs. He's got a, he's got a clone bay. It's Levi, actually, yeah? Okay, yeah. That's what I figured. Levi sounds really funny, anyway. <laughs> At least to my English ears. Huh. Ah, it's either a level 2 clone bay or a level 1 that we didn't get the first shot into hit. I need to be careful not to completely kill their ship here. Happy Mantis Day! <laughs> it's my birthday! What do I get for my birthday? Mantids. There it is. Beautiful. Time to run out of fuel on Sector 8. Uh, I've never actually had that happen. Once I get to Sector 8, the 10 free fuel is usually plenty. No time to get level 3 teleporter to rush second team in the field. Uh, I'm, I... Usually on ships without 4-man teleporter, this teleporter is almost always fluff. I don't actually... Uh, I don't need a Rockman. I don't actually use it offensively against the boss. Oh, he's got level 3 doors, so... I'm not going to board him immediately. He doesn't have heal bay. Let's go ahead and get my defense thrown up here. I'm going to do this. I think I'm actually going to shoot doors with shields. And then mind control the guy on the shields. Because that way my crew will be able to move around their ship. And I want to mind control the other mantis. This guy. To help me fight them in here. Now we have three mantids against their their people. And the rock guy's even tanking the mantis. Very nice. Um, I'll even take out some weapons here. Okay. Do you have to be a little careful here? Because um, now we are outnumbered. So let's go in here. we win this fight? It's rather close. I'm going to actually play this safe. Alright, there we go. It's nice of them to not have a heal bay, by the way. Your birthday is today? No, it's not. Uh, my birthday is on Friday. Why do people keep... Is my, is my message really that unclear? It says, birthday stream on Thursday. How, why do people keep th thinking the day? <laughs> am I am I crazy in that I feel like my message is super clear that says birthday stream on Thursday? Wouldn't that mean you can get infinite amount of events out of that? Wait, would it be funny to see flagship FTL away from you completely intact like they notice you're strong? Hmm. Is there a chance to get a crystal dude from the slave ship? Um, I don't think so. I'm pretty sure the only way to get crystal crew is in a crystal sector. Apart from the special event with the stasis pod or whatever. Oh, God. Welcome aboard. Snack. I have mantids who would love to hang out with you. Nom, 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 nom. 
You just said something about how you got Mantis for your birthday. Oh, <laughs> okay. Today is Wednesday. My bir well, my birthday's not my birthday's not even tomorrow when the birthday stream is happening. My birthday's on Friday. But I'm doing the birthday stream on Thursday, so I can actually, you know, do stuff with my friends for my birthday. So happy Mantis Day. Rand, that's my that's me. Feels birthday, man. All right. Okay. Hey, a store. Maybe we can still get... What am I wanting from the store? Clone Bay. Maybe I would do more boarding if there's a Clone Bay here. 24-hour stream. 12-hour stream. Clone Bay? Clone Bay? Hey, a Clone Bay. Okay. There we go. Reconstructive plus Clone Bay. My favorite. And now... Okay, they took over that repair station, but that's fine. We got plenty of drone parts already. We get our max weapons. Now I just need power. Like, the only thing I really need is power. Okay, that's four missiles. How do I want to do this? I want to do this. Mind control you. Move you guys in here. They will fight us. Okay. Nice. Oh crap, that missile's incoming. I heard the I heard the missile shot. And I was like, well, all I need is my Zoltan shield to not get completely taken out. And it got just enough to get completely taken out, of course. But it's fine. That's what defense drone is for. Oh boy, double rewards, baby. Okay. But yes, I actually, I went to the store yesterday and I bought cake making supplies. So we are prepared for making the cake. The, we're going to make the cake first thing tomorrow. So if you're not able to come till later in the stream, you'll miss, sadly, you'll miss the cake baking portion of the stream. But it'll be the first time I make a cake like ever in my life. So I've got, I've got a pre-made, got a pre-made, um, one of those box cake mixes. I'm not going too crazy. There are 12 power weapon ships. Have we seen 12? I know we've seen 10. I can't remember if we've seen 12 in non-modded or not. Looks like we dodged the missile. Nice. Oh. He got damaged through, man. Damn. Pre-made cake. Well, no, not the cake's not pre-made, but the mix is a... It's a cake mix, basically. So I won't be making my own cake mix. So, not even, not even made from scratch cake. What a noob I am. Get blasted. Oh, nice double reward, man. Make some boiled potatoes cake. <laughs> Been a while since I've seen a five shield enemy. Saw nine power weapons yesterday, though. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't seen a lot of uh, five power weapon, uh, five shields either. All right, I have I have repair drones. I think I'm gonna chance diving for more scrap here. I'm gonna go one, two, three. One, two, three. Maybe I go one, two, three, so I get there at the same time. Look at that repair. Completely isolated. Cause I don't wanna. I wanna be able to jump away if things get too bad. So again, so I need two power to have. Actually, only I only need one power. But I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get one value, value, value. I'm hoping to get one more power and a mind control value point. I'm not even gonna try for four shields. With Zoltan Shield, defense drone, plus hull repair. I'm feeling good. Damn, empty jump. Boiled potato cake. You know what? I bet you could make a cake mix using potato. Pretty sure there's like potato flour. I'm pretty sure potato flour is a thing, right? Am I crazy? I think that's a thing. I might be crazy, but I still think that's a thing. Alright. I tried it I did last time, and I'm pretty sure it's not gonna work, so I'm gonna fight guys in here yet. Potato cake sounds like some kind of quiche. <laughs> I 
No heal bay. Beautiful. Nobody heals. Everybody burns. If I go in here, I think that will pull him. Yeah. Okay. All right, so that is the last scrap we're gonna get except for what we get from the boss. So let's go here and... Let's get the one power. That'll let us have defense drone and I can back up battery this stuff. Um, do I use one hull repair? I'm only missing one health. I'm, not, I'm gonna not use one in case things go really bad in other phases. All righty. Okay, so I'm going to board Ion first. I'm going to use my mind control after my first volley, actually, because that should get us a crew kill. Good doges. Okay, shot one down, dodged another one. That's pretty good. Very nice. Oh, crap. That being a fire actually kind of messed up our thing there. All right, we don't get our second volley. That's fine. We should get the eye on offline here. Hopefully before it fires. Yes. Yeah, he shot the one that missed. Well done, sir. Well done. Way to be worthless. Okay, next volley is going to kill him anyway, so hopefully we can just avoid taking damage. And the hack actually got on our drone control, which is kind of crazy. Ho oh, ho, get those crew kills. Beautiful. Two damage phase one, I think. Not too shabby. Use one whole repair drone. Just get lucky and find a pre-igniter between phases. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> have I ever gotten a pre-igniter between phases of the boss fight? I know I've gotten drones. And I think I have gotten augments, but I don't know if I've ever gotten pre-igniter as an augment. Defense drone pulling through. Yeah, pulling through worthlessly. Worthlessly. Not doing much. Um, I think we will get level 2 sensors. Just in case we need to move our guy, we can still see in there to... Um, mind control. Okay. I'm trying to decide if I want to do much, how much boarding I want to do. Do I want to just go and kill the ion? I mean, the uh, beam guy, or do I want to like? <sighs> with only three shields, I don't want to. I don't want to prolong this phase with this uh, drone control. So I'll probably just kill the one guy in the beam drone room and then try to kill him as quickly as possible. Don't shoot my defense drone. Okay, good. Because I did get a couple crew kills. Well, it wasn't bad. There we go. This should get this guy killed. Oh, wow, actually got through with her with the drone, huh? Okay. That kind of sucks. Double fire in my clone bay from a single missile? Yeah, that seems right. Seems about fair. Oh god, double fire in my door room. What is the bullshit? We have so many bullshit multiple fires from single sources this run. I have to be careful. My clone bay is dead now. Oh man, I take I I'll take some damage here. So close to finishing him too. Okay, you know what? I'm doing this volley and not waiting on the halberd. Okay, okay. All right, we got there. God, two missiles, four fires. I think we just got right there. 
Two missiles, four fires. That seems right, right? Right? Yeah, sure. I'm a bit of a new player to this game, so since this flagship seems to be heavily armed, is there any reason not to just board it and murder everyone since you've got a couple mats and all? Uh, not really, if I... They're in... Um, in the easy and normal difficulty, that's a very good strategy to board in the missile room because it's not connected to the rest of the ship. So you can board the missile room, kill the guys, kill their missiles, you don't have to worry about missiles. In this ship... They've connected those rooms, so it's harder with only two Mantis to go in and kill. Um, I believe all of their crew on the flagship are fully trained, and so they have level 3 heal bay, and so they can rotate back and forth between heal bay and wherever your guys are fighting. So it's very difficult to kill all their crew in the main ship without having crystal crew to lock them in or hacking to keep them from running in and out of rooms. So it's, it's very difficult to do what you're describing uh, with only two crew. With four-man boarding, I often will do uh, a strategy like that. But with three-man boarding, uh, two-man boarding, <laughs> three-man boarding, two-man boarding, that's not usually an option. Only thing I can afford is that. Keep our mind control here. We're probably not going to board at all here. Maybe, but most likely we will not board. So let's follow him, get boarded by however many crew he's going to board us with. I forgot to repair, but that's fine. Hopefully it's fine. Uh, let's actually use our whole repair here. So we don't need our defense drone until they fire the missile. It's pretty good. We'll do one halberd beam. Nope. Actually, you know what? I'm going to save the halberd beam. Okay, got one missile. Not bad. Did it, okay. Counter the mind control. I might, I could probably do this fight without having to leave, is my guess. Uh, well, it depends on this volley right here. Whatever, what, what happens with this volley is gonna depend if we stay or not. Good dodges. Oh, very good dodges. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna try to stick this out. Very nice. Okay, shot his own dudes. I'm cool with that. Normally, I'd run when the second um, group of crew shows up, but because we were able to deal with that so easily and because we've done so much damage already, I think we're good to just finish this. Wow, he doesn't even board us a second time. Ha! <laughs> GG cookie time, boys. Get wrecked. Friggin' double flak one heavy laser halberd beam. Who needs spore shields when you have such good weapons? Get wrecked. Feels good, especially after our first two runs got so rolled. Wrecked, destroyed by fires, whatever you want to say. Um, uh oh, I missed some chat here. Um,. Farb did some six-man boarding earlier. Six-man boarding. So what, do you have level three teleporter with a two-man teleporter? Or did you do like four-man teleporter plus two extra guys or something? If you can defend well, level one mind control can slowly take them out one by one, I guess. Uh, not really, Zdex. I mean, it depends on how much crew they have. They have to have a lot of crew, so they're like three or four-man killing that guy. Killing, killing all of their crew with just level one mind control is really a bad plan. You'd have to have insane defense because you're just going to be taking missiles the whole time. You can actually do eight-man boarding, like the thing with medbay. No, you can't, Kenny. Um, you can bring them back. You can bring back more than the people that can fit in the room, but you can't send out more people than can fit in the room. If you have four-man teleporter and have, like, two extra guys running through as you teleport, it's just going to teleport the four guys. It doesn't work, like, the way you're thinking. I'm pretty sure I've tested that. He had level two two-man boarding. Okay. Don't make me remember my 4-6 crystal B run, huh? <laughs> All right, let's check the score, man. 52-33. Wow, you... Uh, six, 6K was very... Um, um, optimistic there. Not even 30 ships defeated? Wow, that's crazy, Z-Dex. Um, pretty low scrap. Well, 
I would say that's kind of an average run. Yeah, not in my top four. That was an okay run. I mean, our weapons were great. Our score wasn't insane. Became a no weapons run as well. Your 4.6k crystal B run. Just a four-man boarding run. I mean, hey, I like those runs. All right, not a bad start today. Had a couple hiccups, a couple false starts. But uh, that was a good way to start our day. Thank you all so much for watching, by the way. If there's anybody new to the stream, please hit the follow. Hope you guys are enjoying the FTL. Uh, I'm going to stand up straight a really short break. And when I come back, we'll do another ship. Maybe I'll do one that's not quite as strong as the Zoltan ships. Although, I say most of the B ships are not that strong. Maybe I'll try Stealth B and see if we can get that done today. Anyway, thank you guys for hanging out. You guys are amazing. I'll be back in just a second, my friends.